Hey, how you guys doing? Uh, my name is Josh Howard. I'm Chris Sharnagle. And you're watching The Final Cut. Uh, we have a very live studio audience and a very live show for you guys. So uh, let's get right into it. Uh, yeah, let's, let's do this. We're going to yeah. talk about a pretty cool show today, World yeah. War Z. Uh, you know, Brad Pitt. Uh, yeah, Brad, but the only... I'll get, we'll get into it after we watch the show. Okay, okay. Let's, let's just go to it right yeah. now. Just Maybe. Yeah, you know. There we go. Does it live in a jungle? No. Oh. Is it really fast? No. Does it live on the Great Plains of Africa? No. Hey! What is going on? Hold on, guys. Daddy, be careful on the road. Jerry? Get back in your car right now! Remain with your feet! for the job. Baby? Tell the kids I'm coming back. Just know I'm coming back. Put it this way, I'm already petrified of zombies as it is. Like, it's an unhealthy fear of zombies. Like, that scare. I might have to go, like, change my pants now. I'm not a fan of that. Like, especially wave of wave of zombie. Mm. No. You also have to go buy a new chair because yeah, I, I, I'm not cleaning that. Yeah, I don't, I don't think you should. Um, I, can we get a hose or something? It, yeah. Um, I, I'm kind of embarrassed. You, you should be. Uh, um, this movie looks bananas. It's the first Brad Pitt role I've been excited for since Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Um, I'm just not the greatest fan of him, but like he looks actually like halfway decent in this trailer. Uh, you know, long hair, looking like Fabio and stuff. Like this, pretty cool. The Fabio reference. Yeah, wow. I did. Yeah, because it's beautiful. Yeah. Um, he's basically, got, he's got the scruffy beard too. Can't go wrong. You, you can never go wrong, sir. Yeah. I, I got a little little something going on, yeah. you know? I try. In honor just, of Brad Pitt. I try and it doesn't look right. Yeah. It's horrible. It's all right. Things Catchy. happen. But, uh, you know, it looks really good. Uh, the yeah. action's, like, really intense. Like, the zombies basically look like a plague of, like, just, like... You know how, like, you see, like, an anthill and it's just, yeah, like, a whole just, bunch... They, like... It's, like, the same thing. It's, like, it's like the mummy. Remember the mummy? when those, Yes. Those, those, the, the little beetle things that it would eat your flesh? Yeah. It's, it's like, when exactly they come up, you like see that. wave after wave of them and you're, like... That guy's dead. He's yeah. effed. He's gone. Meeting adjourned. That's ridiculous. And it's a lot scarier because, like, these zombies are, like, sprinting. Yeah, the yeah that's a... That, all like, right. there's the one scene where it's, like, the running of the zombies. Yeah, it's, like, like yeah, screw running of the bulls. Like, they're, like, running of zombies. Like, the thing that, like, I am petrified of zombies. Like, the slow-moving zombies I can deal with, the, the, uh, I cannot run them. Yeah. But when they nip up, 
and like land on their feet and run a four two forty like Usain Bolt's running after me. No, exactly. I, I'm not handling that. My mind's gonna explode and I'm gonna be crying as I'm like in the theater going, no, I don't want to do this no more now. I don't like zombies. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like zombies. I'm gonna be oh. blunt honest. Yeah, I mean, but <laughs> what? You like Inception you, sounds. I'm, I'm, yeah. Inception. Yeah. That sound is just oh, yeah, that, all that, over that, it's this like, trailer. It's it's the Inception slash Transformer yeah. sound, like like. Yeah. I'm waiting for a Transformer to pop and start blowing crap apart. Yeah. You know, like Optus probably be like, they're they're zombies and start just laying them out. Yeah. It's crazy. Um, yeah. but I mean, it looks like it's gonna be a good movie. It, it but look, I'm scared, though. Not so just I. because of the zombies. So am I. No, but it's the same director as uh, Quan Masalis. Okay. Uh, which was. Oh. A lot of people feel like it was the worst Bond film I didn't of all mind it. time. I, I, I enjoyed Quantum of Solace. I, like, I'm not saying it was the greatest movie ever, but I was like, oh, okay. Popcorn flick. It wasn't horrible, but the Bond standard is like... Oh, yeah, the Bond standard is high. Yeah. And it was below the Bond standard, but it was still like, if you look it up uh, against other movies, there's other, there's other stuff that's not as good as that. Like that you know what I mean? Well, I mean, if you put it up next to Daredevil, I mean, like, just <laughs> obviously. Blow, blow. Obviously. Blow. I'm, I'm sorry, Affleck. Oh, I'm man. sorry. Stop, stop, stop. It's not even saying sorry to Affleck. It's saying sorry to Michael Clark Duncan. Whatever. Michael Clark Duncan's the man. He, he was the man. He was. Past tense. Anyway. True. Uh, we got a commercial break. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. So, uh. Cancel. Coming up next, we'll have a special guest coming in to talk about the new Twilight movie. Yeah. Yay! And yeah. then we'll fill you in what's going on in the movie industry. So uh, stay tuned to the final cut. Woo! Woo!